Alrighty, ladies and gentlemen, just a little vid about WWE there, a little rant or whatever. Try to, to please the people there who absolutely need wrestling vids or whatever the fuck. I'll call it WWE is cheap and boring. Something like this there. In reality, people there, I don't give enough of a fuck to even rant about this shit anymore. You know what I mean? I don't give enough of a fuck to get upset by this product. You know, back in the day, you know, I had all that passion, all that anger, you know, oh fuck, this product needs to be better, go back to how it was in the past, nah, 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 nah. Now it's like, yeah, I don't even give a shit anymore. I'm at the point where it's like, okay, bring WrestleMania, get it over with so I can just like not watch Raw because at this point, it's just a waste of my fucking time, a waste of my life. It is what it is, you know. Um, today, I'm at my father's place there. I'm watching wrestling from the 1970s, okay? Wrestling from Quebec from 40 years ago. For some reason, wrestling from 40 years ago is... 40 times better than the wrestling of today. How the fuck does that even happen there? I'm not talking about The Rock and Steve Austin. I'm not talking about the Hogan era. I'm talking about wrestling from Quebec. From the 1970s. Pat Patterson cutting promos, shit like this. A million times better, more entertaining than today's wrestling. How the fuck does that even add up there? You have 40 years to evolve. <laughs> you know? You'd figure the wrestlers would be better by now. Shit like this. But it's become super, super fucking boring. And cheap. It's not funny. It's not exciting. The matches aren't exciting. There's nothing unique. Nothing original. It all fucking sucks. It's a big fucking waste of time. It's true, man. Elimination Chamber. You got three garbage divas matches on one show. Not good matches. Three shit matches. A tag team turmoil match with nobodies. Complete fucking nobodies. You get one chamber match... And it's Bray Wyatt who wins the belt. You know, you might have nerdy guy. Yeah, I like Bray Wyatt. Yeah. Guys like that might be excited or they might pretend to be excited. You know what I'm saying? But that's not real star quality there. Kevin Owens and Jericho. That shit is beyond fucking lame. All of it is fucking cheap and lame. It's not even good WWE now. It's not good. It's not worth fucking get pissed off over. It's not worth it. Staying up till 11 o'clock. Fucking people in the UK staying up till 4 in the morning. <laughs> Fuck. To watch shit wrestling garbage like that. It's, this is a big fat fucking waste of time. It is what it is, you know. You still got people who like it. You got guys on Twitter there. They wear fucking Alexa Bliss t-shirts. They show this off thinking that they're cool and shit. Those are called queers people. And 12-year-old mongoloids. That's what that is there. I'm almost 34 years old. Is that what I'm supposed to do there? Am I supposed to buy a Carmella t-shirt and try to impress people online? I'm a real wrestling fan! Is that really what we're supposed to do with our lives, people? Buy Carmella t-shirts and try to impress teenagers and mongoloids by telling them that we're real wrestling fans. I don't think that's what life is, is meant to be there. 
whether you believe in, in evolution or Jesus Christ or whatever the fuck you believe in. I don't think that's the plan there. We're going to bring humans on this planet there. We're going to buy t-shirts of garbage women wrestlers. We're going to try to impress retards. Straight up fucking retards. We're going to try to impress other retards there about how cool we are because we like a shit product. I don't think that's what God intended for us to do there on this planet. You know what I'm saying? I don't think that's what life is about there. Cavemen back in the day. Big fucking cavemen fucking having sex with with women and eating and fucking killing animals, eating them and stuff. Do you think these cavemen one day we're gonna watch shit wrestling there? Men pretending to fight. We're gonna buy t-shirts of Natalia Neidhart. I don't think that's what anybody had in mind there. Our ancestors. We're gonna fucking fight. We're gonna win wars and shit. And just so we can watch gay wrestling and, and try to impress goofs on the internet. I don't think that's what we're meant to do with our lives. Watching garbage like this. I mean, come on there. Come on, fuck. At this point, everybody has to be trolling. Because that's what we're doing in this community. We're so fucking bored there. We have to troll each other fucking pick arguments with each other because we're so fucking bored, you know what I'm saying? Mongoloid wrestling fans. <laughs> TNA's good! <laughs> you know, that's not normal. We shouldn't be talking to fucking straight-up psychopaths and mongoloids online. No! TNA isn't good! Yes! TNA's good! I don't think that's what life is meant to be, people, there. At this point, it's a big fucking joke. WWE is super cheap. It's super boring, and we're just wasting our fucking time. Just a little bit of real talk. I'm always going to watch wrestling. Good for you, fuck. Good for you. Go take your fucking brain medication there, shit like this. Put on your fucking t-shirt of Nikki Bella. Show off your DVDs. Try to impress teenagers there. But in reality, this whole wrestling shit is just a big fat fucking waste of time. It is what it is. Just being honest there. We're just wasting our fucking lives with this shit. If you enjoy it, good for you there. But uh, I don't seriously don't know how you can enjoy it at this point. It's a big fucking queer fest. That's all it is. Queers and phonies pretending to like something. I'm always going to like wrestling. Good for you, fuck. Good for you. Until next time. Peace.